What's up everybody? This is a video on everything you need to get started in tissue culturing and also some optional items at the end. Links for all of this is in the description. All of the main things in this list that you absolutely need came out to about $326. I tried to keep it less but this is everything that I would want to start tissue culturing. So first off you'll need a big plastic tub with a locking lid to make a still air box. There's plenty of tutorials on how to make a still air box. You basically just cut two holes in the top of the lid to fit your hands in. You're going to need a pressure cooker. The bigger the better. I recommend the 23 quart pressure cookers by Presto. They're about 100 bucks. I got mine used on Facebook Marketplace for like 30 bucks. You can look on Craigslist, Facebook, and you can usually find these with a good deal. You can buy a used pressure cooker. The only thing that goes bad on them is the gaskets. So you can order the gaskets straight from Presto and just replace them if you buy an old one. You're going to need MS Media Powder. This powder has all the vitamins and sucrose to keep plants thriving and alive. You can find this online at Tissue Culture Supply Labs. You're going to need bleach, spray bottles. The one I linked comes with three spray bottles. And sturdy plastic cups that are autoclavable. Slime cups on Amazon work really well. I've linked those in the description. Paper towels. Distilled water or RO water. You can just buy distilled water per, by the gallon at any grocery store. I have a reverse osmosis system. That's the water I use. Zero TDS water on tap. Milliliter syringes. I recommend getting 10 milliliter syringes and also one milliliter syringes. Hand sanitizer, a scalpel, and replacement blades, disinfecting wipes, pH meter, Ziploc freezer bags, hydrogen peroxide, rubbing alcohol. You need agar or gel and gum. Agar is less expensive, but it's not as clear as gel and gum. Gel and gum and agar are the gelling agents in the media that makes it gel-like. Gel and gum has really went up in price I noticed. It's about $30 for two ounces. There are some tissue culture labs online that you can get more bulk of it for a little bit of a higher price, but it's a better deal on the, on the plant labs online. Mason jars, latex gloves, forceps, basically like some long tweezers work really well. Antibacterial dish soap, measuring cups, and a scale. I recommend a digital scale. So all that together was around $326 to get started. If you have some stuff that's already on the list, obviously that makes the price lower. You can kind of research and see what you absolutely need, but that's everything that I would absolutely need to start. Now I'll list the optional items if you're really taking tissue culture serious and you want to take it to the next level. The first one is a laminar flow hood. I built mine for around $450. I didn't make an extensive tutorial on building it, but there is a video that I'll link about building it. Plant Preservation Solution. This is a product you can add into your media that kind of just helps prevent contaminants. It's basically an antifungal, antibiotic type thing. A Bunsen burner or an infrared sterilizer. I have a Bunsen burner, but I'm going to make a video on how you can make an infrared sterilizer for under $50. Just waiting on the stuff in the mail. PGRs, plant growth regulators. These are basically plant hormones that can make plants grow in different ways. There's cytokinins that help multiply plants and promote shoot growth. And then there's also auxins, which promote root growth. Sodium hydroxide for pH up. You can also use uh, baking soda for pH up. Hydrochloric acid for pH down. You can also use vinegar for pH down. Glass beakers, just ordered some of these online. I think it's gonna make everything a lot easier and a magnetic stir. Again, I've linked all these products in the description. I'm getting back into tissue culturing, so I made a list of everything I have and everything I need to get. So I've basically got everything ordered and in the mail, and I'm going to get started tissue culturing soon, and I'll make videos on that. Thanks for watching. Peace.